you want to make a robot that people trust, humans need to have an expectation for how it might move and how it might behave. So how do we build a new morphology, something that's different, and yet has cues and signals that humans can trust? But that, that requires an almost anthropological assessment of what is it do we trust? Starting from the bottom, the wheels are exposed so you can see which way it's gonna turn. Moving up, the, the base, the center of this is low, so it feels stable, it feels safe. It is stable, it is safe. The center of mass is low. It has these, these eyes that are at kind of the height of maybe a companion animal, a dog. The arms, the grippers are intentionally facing upward because if you go forward to someone or down, those are scarier motions. Palms up, coming up, it's a much more friendly interaction. Even coming all the way to the top, the fact that it can perceive the world from the same height you and I do means it has the same sight lines. You can trust that it can, can see you. And those little cues, by keying into those things, we can build a robot that hopefully you don't notice all those things. Hopefully it just feels comfortable.